what I'm saying? It's it's been a like a popular situation going on in the city with you know what I'm saying, Foley and Murder Gang. Like what really caused that split if you can't speak about it? If not, then we can move forward. Me personally, to be totally honest, because I really don't give a fuck. I feel like when you um it like this. This what I feel like, true or not, it may not be true. But I feel like PB wanna rap, he feel like being under Yayo gonna stop him because Yayo, a lot of doors closed for Yayo, so I can't go the same route as Yayo because I'm only gonna go as far as Yayo taking me, and if he not taking me there, you know what I'm saying? It makes sense though, right? There. It makes sense, but it's like ways you go about there. It's like, you know what I'm saying? If I don't wanna, if I don't wanna fuck with a nigga because I feel like he was slowing me down, I tell him, I'm sorry, I don't wanna fuck with you, fam. Uh, I, I can't really just fuck with you like that. You in the way, I got kids or something. I got people I got to take care of or something. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, that was one way to go about it, but just, I feel like people were making up lies. You know what I'm saying? Doing other shit, making shit seem like it was something that it wasn't. Like, just cause you want to stop fucking with a nigga. Okay, okay, you know that makes sense. I see what you're saying. But it just yeah. was about it. That, es that escalated the shit. I don't know, I don't hear too much. As far as from the internet, you know what I'm saying? I heard a little bit on the internet, a little slick shit, but I don't, I don't see it. Right, okay. Like, Damn, that shit crazy, bro. Now, me personally, bro, my favorite song is Everybody Know It, you feel me? Because you got on a different type of beat, you know what I'm saying? You show like a different style of your music. What influenced you to get on that type of song, like the UK drill beat? I ain't going to lie, we just put up beats and jump on them. For real? Like, we don't even, we ain't even writing to them, we just jump You freestyle it? Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Damn. What, okay, so let's say if I went to a, a Beto recording session, what is your process to record music? Like, what all do you need to have? Shit. Some weed. That's it. That's Some it. Some weed and a good beat. For sure, you just punch in, huh? Yep. Yeah. Shit show, shit show, bro. Now, uh, you just dropped the project. You know what I'm saying? Side show dope. What can people expect from that project if you haven't heard it yet? You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of, it's really a lot of, um, a lot of stuff that I feel like my fans want to hear that they probably would never heard. You know what I'm saying? Like when you post little snippets of them, they want to hear it. It was like a little mixtape to really get ready to prepare me for some bigger. You know what I'm saying? So, for sure, for sure. Now, see, what can we expect from Beto moving forward on the music tip? Um, I ain't gonna lie, I got like a lot of big things in store, so it's like, expect Beto to be out of Dallas, out the way, for sure. But other than that, I really just, I'm linked in with this producer, you know what I'm saying? He tied in with like 808 Mafia and shit like yeah. that, so shit. My whole next mistake gonna just be me and Baby Top, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so shit, big. we gonna really like do everything the right way. For sure. So shit. Now, new red bottles, bro, you know what I'm saying? You hit over a million views on there. How was you feeling once you seen that shit like past a million views? You was lit or what? Like what was going through your head? I, I would, I, I ain't just gonna too much say I was lit because I, I already figured what the people that was on there was gonna do that. You know what I'm saying? So I really expected it to probably go a little farther. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it did. How did that shit even come about though? Like, because you got a lot of niggas on there that go crazy in the city. Yeah, I had, um, I always come say it with tools and shit. He gave me a little price I couldn't be. So I ended up paying him for a feature and really never ever got the feature from him. So shit, I ended up doing that song and shit. Couldn't, like I told you, I'd be freestyling. Sometimes I get stuck on that shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So shit, I had got stuck on that hoe. ended up sending him, like, hey, bitch, jump on that hoe with me. Yeah. When he jumped on that, um, shit, I fuck with Queen producer, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if that's how Queen heard of me. Queen and Finn. But shit, he reached out to me shit and told me he wanted to get on. So shit, of course I was gonna let him get on it. You sure. know what I'm saying? I, that's why I look at it like shit, me, Queen, and Tuesday. But they just dropped, um, I forgot the name of the song. They dropped some song, but it was little, it was just turned up. You know, they should be dropping together a lot. They should be turned up. So I, I felt like off them two alone, it was gonna turn up. Yeah, and then you got Yayo on there, you know what I'm saying? Like Yayo don't really do music with outside niggas like that. How did you get him on that song? Cause I got them. See, me and Yay was already thugging. It don't be too many times where a nigga just be like, "Hey, listen to my music." So shit, at this point in time, he be let me hear your shit. So I'm playing them. I bitch, I got Queen um and Tuesday on his hoe. Yeah. Hey damn, bitch, I'm finna get on that hoe. 
it really constructed the song though. Like it was just us, me rapping, and then Tuesday rapping. So he got down. We're like, yeah, I'm a rap last. We gonna put Queen and Tuesday together. You rap first, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so he, he orchestrated the song like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 So goddamn, um, um, engineer or whatever or whatnot. So then, boom. You know, he put his name first on there because, you know, that was going to turn it up. Just right. Like, he ain't dropped in a minute. So, shit, that was really what made it do the numbers. You know, yeah, he ain't dropped in a minute. Got Queen and Tuesday. So, shit, for sure. Yeah. Now, who does b want to work with, like, period, in the rap game right now? Who do you want to work with in the future? Um, I ain't going to lie. It, it ain't too many. It ain't too many. Um, It ain't too many rappers that I really just don't fuck with. Like, you know what I'm saying? Nah, the rappers now, they like to, like a lot of them go hard, so shit. It ain't just no picks. I got producers I'll be wanting to fool with, though. Damn. Do you feel like an artist and a producer have to have, like, a, a good chemistry to work together? Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Because, like, that's like I'm saying, me and this, me and this dude, Baby Top. I don't know if you did for me with him, but he was sending me beats, you know what I'm saying? Right. And, I would never really just feeling them or whatever, whatnot, but shit, he came to the city and just fucked me hands on, heard my sound and start, you know what I'm saying, making shit to that, heard my other music, start making shit to that, and it's like, you know what I'm saying, all my new music been on his shit, and it's easy to rap on his shit, you know what I'm saying? For sure, damn, for sure. that's lit, that's lit, uh, congratulations on all the success as well, bro, you know what I'm saying, you been doing some big shit for sure. Now, let me ask you this, bro, like, if I wanted to get in, in 4E, or if somebody just came to you and said, I want to be in 4E, would y'all accept him with open arms? Me personally, Foe not mine, so I wouldn't accept nobody else. <laughs> so. You know what I'm saying? But really, when it come down to yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? It ain't no we down there like family, so that's what that is, you know what I'm saying? I know I ain't I ain't signed to yeah, yeah, you know, I do my own thing. He do his own thing, you know what I'm saying? Sure. That's that, you know what I'm saying? We just like family. But if he fuck with you, and feel like you rap hard, you know, he gonna try to put you up on this when he try to turn you up. For sure. He ain't gonna try to get nothing up out of you or nothing. He just, he feel like you hard, he fuck with you. For sure. That's love, that's love, bro. Now, just, I wanna ask some random ass questions, bro. You know what I'm saying? For Beto, Instagram or Facebook? Because you active on both. Which one do you prefer? Now, Instagram, but two months ago, Facebook. <laughs> Why you say that? Shit, that's just why I'm my people. I don't really too much know nobody on Instagram. I don't be knowing the people that be saying stuff on there. For sure, for sure. Now, shit, Dallas woman or Fort Worth woman? Um, I got to go with Dallas. It's just bigger, so it's more. <laughs> for sure. That makes sense. That makes sense. Now, shit, what's your favorite designer, bro? You always in designer and shit like that? What's your favorite brand? I say clothes. I say Louis Vuitton. That's what I really like. Like a smooth shit. Shoes, red bottoms. <laughs> okay, it makes sense. It's only right. For sure, bro. Now, shit, where can people follow you at on social media? They Bido Rich Ass. B E D O R I C H A S Z.